G'day everyone, welcome to x Art. I'm Chrissy, and in today's painting demonstration I'm going to be painting with pastels on paper but before I go um, before we go into the demonstration I just wanted to talk to you very briefly um, just about or I just wanted to share really um, my thoughts on uh, my strengths and my weaknesses in regards to portraits and stuff like that. Um, years ago when I took up art again one of the things that I really wanted to get into was portraits and painting faces and I really wanted to get good at it but I was shocking um, you know I would be painting an eye and it'd be all warped or a nose would be wonky or you know even got to the point where um, I was um, painting faces with eyes closed because I was you know just a bit scared of how I didn't even wasn't sure how to do the eyes properly but I thought I can't I'm not going to get very far if I do this so I thought you know what practice so what I did was I decided to practice and get better at it and I've had a lot of misses and some hits on the way and I'm sure that and I know that I've certainly improved from when I first started uh, but you know it's it's practice and it's a, it's admitting that you know your strengths and the weaknesses and I'm gonna try to hone in on all my weaknesses and try to improve and you know there's some um, some terrific artists out there and they do some awesome work and you know good luck to them they've done a, uh, they do fabulous work and I learn from them so I'm always practicing as well so anyway I just thought I'd share and and just let you view the, the demonstration. The art supplies I'll be using today are pan pastels, soft pastels and pastel pencils. I actually use quite a lot of pastel pencils in this one, um, quite a lot, yeah. Uh, well, the surface that I'm painting on is uh, pastel matte. This is uh, 360 GSM, acid-free, archival, uh, very good for us artists and comes from a pad of 12. It's uh, 30 centimetres by 40 centimetres. Also comes in large sheets and smaller sheets as well. Uh, here I'm just um, laying down as much colour as I can and oh my goodness, he's looking quite pasty there. Uh, but I do adjust, very scary actually, uh, but I do adjust the, um, the tone as well. Um, yeah. Anyway, this painting is uh, part of my element collection and this fellow his name is Amel. Amel is the air king of diamonds. And um, uh, as is the eagle, the most powerful of birds, so is Amel in his realm. And so I don't think you can get more powerful than that. Uh, for him, anyway. Uh, yeah, um, he has a gift, and his, he has the gift of foresight. Um, and uh, his eyesight is, uh, uh, and the eyesight of an eagle. Uh, only so much more so uh, yeah or well, you know they've all got all these characters of mine have got stories so this is his and here I've um, yeah just painting an eagle uh, well, I haven't done very many animals and just I know um, hopefully I'll get um, better at it um, but quite enjoyed doing it you know um, and I'm just trying to follow my reference, pay careful attention. And it's not, I'm not painting every feather exactly how it is in the reference, but I'm just making sure that, you know, all my strokes are going the right way and the feathers are sort of pointing in the right direction. But yeah, I had a lot of fun doing this. But anyway, I'll um, leave you to uh, view the rest of this uh, demonstration.
Well, thanks for watching. If this is the first time you've viewed my videos and you'd like to see more of my videos, uh, please subscribe. Don't forget to press that. There's a button bell thingy there. Um, uh, subscribe, like, share. But until the next time, bye for now.